is up you guys, I'm Charmix and today uh, we'll be looking at some more reddit, so we'll be looking at the subreddit r slash memes. Now these these aren't dank memes, but they're they're hopefully going to be quite funny memes nonetheless. But anyway, with that being said, hopefully you guys like this video. Without any further ado, let's begin. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, step right up and get yourself a shirt. Get yourself a shirt at Beanie Boy Clothing. Link in the description. I think Pokemon Go is up to something. Pokemon Go, why not step outside for a bit? Emergency alert, tornado warning in the area. <laughs> Laughs at Sith Lord. Maybe the reason why they want you to go outside is that the tornado would throw all the uh, the creatures up in the air, and now that's where you gotta catch them. <laughs> when you're getting up from the toilet seat, but your stomach suddenly does bruh 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 bruh. There is another. Bruh. Bruh, bruh, bruh. I think that means you're sick. I mean, that, that should not normally happen. Who are you just spending your Valentine's Day with? Me. <laughs> Wait, what is Valentine's Day? Is it, I think it's coming up. February 14th. Okay, so that's, uh, what, that's next week, I think? No, it's this Friday coming up. This Friday coming up is Valentine's Day. I did not know that until right friggin' now. Oh, well. When you finally give your body a vegetable after days of Hot Pockets and Mountain Dew. Health. Health, health. <laughs> that's the definition of health. Although it's funny, it's also a little bit too relatable. Like, I eat so much junk food that I know it's not healthy. Don't get me wrong, I do, like, I love salad. Certain types of salad, like, that my parents make, they make either Greek or Italian salad, which, you know, like, the, the Greek one has, like, feta cheese and, like, olives, and, oh, it's so good with the dressing. I, I freaking love it. Oh, it's... I, I would take it over certain types of junk food. I honestly would. I love it so much. But we don't have it every day, and I'm too lazy to make it, so if it's not around... I'm just gonna eat friggin' junk food like frozen pizzas or. <laughs> oh my goodness, brownies, you know, whatever. <laughs> Daddy, help me! There's a ghost in my closet. Help, Dad. What do you have? This would be less terrifying if I actually had a kid. <laughs> Last night I was thinking when I move out, whenever that is, what I wanna do is I wanna set up like fish, fish wire traps around my house with like little bells on them. So if I'm sleeping and someone like either breaks in or something like rattles it, I'd be able to get up and react in time. But I was also thinking, what if I start hearing the rattling and there's no intruder or anything like that? Like, that's terrifying. And I was thinking that last night before going to bed. <laughs> Found in a local parking lot. This vehicle is equipped with millennial anti-theft device. Oh, freaking uh, manual. Holy crap. That's Boomer as F. Yeah, that's pretty boomer, and pretty accurate as well, because let's face it, not many people know how to drive, uh, what's that, drive stick, drive manual, because, like, I don't. I tried at one point, my dad tried teaching me, I just hate it, I hate it. Me, making unboxing video, everyone else at the funeral. <laughs> what's up, guys, today we're gonna be unboxing my grandfather. Oh, that's, oh, no. <laughs> my boss, you're fired. Pauses, Peron. Why? Why fire me? What did I do? <laughs> no, don't do it! When you're building some Legos and finish a really complicated part and the instructions hit you with this. <laughs> Four times. Or worse, eight times. That's almost like when you're playing Uno and you get the you get the plus four. <laughs> Recent study reveals strong link between enjoying ironic memes and suffering from severe depression. You got me there! Is this how they're gonna diagnose people in the future? <laughs> You're at the doctor's office, they show you a bunch of memes, and you- <laughs> they just see your reaction to them. Your surname is based on what your ancestors did. People with the surname Dickinson. <laughs> yeah, that probably makes for some awkward, uh, awkward family reunions. 13 to 17 year olds. Edgy political ideologies that have killed millions of people in the past. Pretty accurate. Pretty accurate. You see all these people nowadays trying to bring back, uh, comedy. Them. Because it's worked so many times in the past, and it has definitely not killed 50 million people. Oh my goodness. This is why we gotta learn from history, people. Or you're doomed to repeat it, and people hate history class. President's spokesman says he can't speak for the president. This is real, I saw this. I have several questions. <laughs> Although it's my job to speak for him, I can't really speak for him, you know. <laughs> I don't know about you, but it sounds like you do not have the best job security. Spawn camping at its finest. Aww. 
What's it doing there? It can't be just waiting for birds to come back to the nest, is it? I mean, birds, birds aren't that dumb. Small but mighty. Ladies, please hear me out. <laughs> Look how that little one, that little one packs a punch, doesn't it? It's not the size of the uh, the flashlight, it's how bright it is, everyone. Is that really how bright this big one is? Or are the batteries just really dead? Because this must have so many batteries. What is this also used as like a walking cane or something? Why is it so long if it just makes that little brightness? There has to be another use for it, or the batteries are just dead. Because there's no way that should be that dull. Dude receives a death threats uh, from Italy after posting photos of Kiwi Pizza? You get what you haven't deserved. Kiwi Pizza, what is wrong with people? I recently found out that some country, I don't know which one, puts bananas on their pizza, which I think is a little bit, a little bit wild. But this, this is just too much. This is just too much. If this is true, I mean, I can I can kind of sympathize with the, Ita the Italians on this. Kiwis on pizza, you, you should be at a psych ward. Six examples of successful rebranding. So you got Google to Google. Oh, I like that little logo change. It's very subtle. You have Lego to Lego, much better. Starbucks to Starbucks, much better. Uh, Federal Express to FedEx, much better. American Autism Association to TikTok. Much better. Me in my 70s with Alzheimer's laughing at memes again. <laughs> oh my goodness. I guess maybe that's the upside to Alzheimer's. Uh, you know, you can see the same memes over and over. <laughs> And you get the same amount of humor from it. I could you imagine how you have like a meme catalog where like every day you just go through the same memes but you don't remember seeing them so they're just as funny as they were before. I guess that's a positive to the horrible situation of having Alzheimer's. Me, walked past the bush. My brain, take a leaf. Me, why that's stupid. My brain, you just gotta. Me, you got me there. This is so, why, why does this happen? I find myself doing this. Or at least I used to when I used to walk outside. <laughs> Like, I remember so many times I would do this, I just pick stuff. Maybe because I'm a little bit ADHD and I always need to have my hands doing something, maybe that's why. But it's so annoying. It's so annoying because I, I would do this so much. I I'll even do it nowadays, but I don't really walk outside that often. <laughs> Adobe has developed software that can detect Photoshop in an image. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's horrible. That's horrible. Also, I don't know if I believe that Adobe can do that. Yes, I believe it can do uh, or detect some things, which are quite obvious. But I think some things it won't be able to detect. Like very minor, minor changes. Just like fixing up skin flaws. I, I think that would be very difficult. It might be able to detect it, but I think it'd be very difficult. I'm only friends with 25 letters of the alphabet. Why not 26? Don't know why. <laughs> There's a new meme format? That's funny. Most snakes. I'm not to be trifled with, fool. Arabian sand boa. Guys wanna do some drugs? Guys wanna do some drugs? They look so cute. They look so freaking cute. I saw this image the other day of this snake. <laughs> it's so adorable. Oh my goodness. <laughs> is it poisonous or something? Like, it probably still has fangs, I would assume. But it is one of the, the cutest looking snake. The eyes, the eyes make it so adorable. <laughs> <laughs> How does a Jewish person make tea? How? He brews it. <laughs> I like that one. That's silly. I like this new meme format. Diarrhea is hereditary. How? It runs in your genes. <laughs> oh, I actually really like this meme. When I tell Mickey to use the wrong mouse catool. <laughs> yes, I am pretty despicable. <laughs> That's what you get, Mickey. That's what you get. Whatever it takes to make Mickey's life hard. <laughs> Friend, you can't make a meme with no context and expect people to understand. Me. <laughs> Things are about to get wild. Ron. Hey, Harry. Have you ever snitched on someone? <laughs> like when he reveals his scar, but it's six and nine. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. I've been recording for way too long. But uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up if you're new. Hit subscribe to the family. And uh, yeah, make sure you go check out the merch link in the description. I'll see you guys next time. Boop!